From the late 80s to the early 90s, the two best heavyweights in the world were Iron Mike Tyson and Evander the Real Deal Holyfield. Tyson possessed an exceptional combination of speed and power, great head movement, and a killer's instinct. Holyfield possessed great footwork, an outstanding work rate, celebrated durability, and an admirable attraction to the slugfest. At their peaks, in the early 90s, the boxing world begged to see them two in the ring together. But it's just, I'm the best fighter. November 8th, I have the championship back on my waist. On the way, I can feel that I'm my best when I fought the best people. Mike Tyson is one of the best, and I'm looking forward to fighting him. Due to an unfortunate series of circumstances, it didn't happen. Or did it? Almost as a prank, or an experiment, the boxing gods folded their arms and said, you want Tyson and Holyfield in the ring together? Let's do it. And let's name him Ikea Biabuchi. Strongly built, great footwork, an exceptional combination of speed and power, durability, head movement, an outstanding work rate, a killer's instinct, and an attraction to the slugfest. Oh yes, and let's dress him in black shoes and trunks. Boxing fans, enjoy Ikea Biabuchi. Hi, this is Joe Cortez. You're watching Showbiz, The Adult. Oh, this is Bernard Hopkins, Showbiz, The Adult. I'm out.